Welcome back, folks. Ed Rose with the Art of Hitting. I got a picture here uh, with Ted Williams, and the next shot is me and uh, Pete Rose. I put these pictures uh, in here because I, I want to let you know I've been around some of the greatest hitters and, and picked their brains in baseball, and uh, I can't, couldn't put up all the pictures of the great softball players I played with. Um, you name them, I either played with them or against them. Got a lot of experience, many, many years. I think it's 57 years. 57 years in softball, over 200 and some titles. I mean, the list goes on. But I'm here just to share with you what I consider the uh, five principles of the art of hitting. Be aggressive. And that's the story that Pete Rose uh, shared with me. He said, uh, Ed, uh, well, I asked, asked him, I said, Pete, uh, what's, the, what's the number one rule of hitting? He said, be aggressive, Ed. I said, what's number two? He said, be aggressive, Ed. And I said, well, what's number three? He said, be aggressive. So as smart as I am, I figured it, that was important to be aggressive. No, I've always been aggressive. Uh, he just confirmed it. Now, number two is let the ball come to you. Don't go after the ball. You know, sometimes, you know, people chase the ball. I'm talking about chasing a, chasing a bad ball. Let it come to you, come to the point that uh, you can strike it well with your arms extended. Keep your hands back as your front foot plants. Always keep your hands back. You, you can even, you can, you know, have a semi-bad swing and still hit well if you got your hands back. Watch the ball hit the bat. Probably the biggest uh, thing you need to focus on. And I know all these rules and I've practiced them, but I make mistakes. But watch the ball hit the bat. Stay within yourself. You know, I can't be Bob Waldike. I'd like to be. Or Bruce Mead. Uh, I'm Ed Rose. I stay within myself. You be yourself. Now, let me take a minute just to review my concept of the art of hitting. The art of hitting, hitting is the, uh, the fact that everyone does it a little bit differently. Uh, there are basic rules, like the five principles, they're basic. But you can do it many, many different ways if you're successful. If you do something that looks like it's out of uh, sync or, you know, what's normal for softball, then um, if you do it well, it's going to work for you. What you have here is a couple of slow motion shots of uh, you, you see me following the basic rules of let the ball come to me, uh, you know, keeping my hands back and watching the bat hit the ball. You, I think you'll see the those uh, particular principles being followed by all the videos you see uh, on this clip. Staying within yourself simply means if you're not a home run hitter, don't try to hit a home run. Now, um, you know, I mean, gap shots is what you're looking for. Uh, if you're a young guy, you, it's good to go ahead and try to become a home run hitter. If you're an older guy, it's probably better just to, you know, go with base hits. Now, look at the DC here. He kind of, you know, I put this in here because, you know, his mechanics are technically all wrong, basically, if you look at it. But, uh, you know, he hits the ball and he strikes the ball well. He sees the bat hit the ball. You see he's watching the bat hit the ball. I say it over and over. Look what he's got his bat. It's under. It's, you know, his hands aren't really right. But the guy hits over 800 most of the time. How he hits me most of the time. Uh, and he's led our uh, 75 and over team in home runs one year. Uh, I think he hit two. <laughs> I don't know, maybe three. But uh, uh, now we got a lot of guys hitting the inside the park home runs. But uh, you got to stay within yourself, especially when you're a. Uh, uh, a senior. Now this young lady just hit that ball out of the park with that swing. What? No, this is the swing she hits the ball out of the park with. Watch it. Watch this. Boom! And she says, "Catch that to the outfielder." You know, I got that off the internet. This young lady, you look at her mechanics. Uh, you know, she's doing what we talked about. Watch her here. You know, she gets a leg up like this. Look like, Get off! Boom! And turn. That's pretty good, man. She's about to probably a a buck, I don't know, buck forty maybe in weight. I don't know, heavy she, but she got good mechanics. Now here's one of the best home run hitters in our town, um, Gary Benton. He hits it over four hundred feet at times. Watch him. 
Step. Plant. Hands back. Come around. Boom. Now he hit that square, so he's line shot. And if he was want to hit it out, he'd have spun it. Let's see what next shot we got of uh, maybe Gary. Maybe yeah, this is Gary again. Let's see uh, again using his overlap grip. Waiting for the ball. Waiting for the ball to get to him. Steps. His hand's still back. Around. Now he spins that puppy. He got on the bottom of it. And it's, uh, it's a long way. He hits it in practice about 350, 360 consistently. He's a powerful man. About 51 years old, I believe. Yeah. Look, he's an artist. He's looking at his art. <laughs> Watching his design. This is my son, Scott. See, he's got that it, hands are back. Step, hands back. Now he hits it. Like he hit the farthest shot there. He hit one 410 over that house in the background. You see way over there? <laughs> he hit one over there you know, once or twice. Um, he can hit it, man. Big old boy now. He's 6'2", about 250. So uh, he's big in his daddy. He can hit it, though. He's a good clutch hitter. Now, he'll top that one, hit it on the ground. But, uh, yeah, now let's see. We'll see a swing here in in real time. Boom. Now, this is one of the best hitters in the game, Paul Stanley. Paul Stanley is an amazing athlete, 6'6", six, 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 something like that. Runs in the outfield like a deer. He used to be like the Michael Jordan of the, of the basketball league in in uh, Australia. He's a hell of an athlete. He just hit that out of uh, uh, National Stadium up in Coco. Team here called the Brevard County Manatees, and also the Washington Nationals held spring training here for about 11 years. That one cleared both walls, so that'll uh, end the inning. And so we're we'll ending on the one of the best hitters in the game, Paul Stanley. And uh, you guys uh, follow them rules. Be aggressive. Let the ball come to you. Keep your hands back as your front foot plants. Watch the bat hit the ball. So important. Stay within yourself, folks. See you next time. Hit subscribe. Thank you.